Hey, in this video, we are going to talk about top 10 things to do in Vancouver, Canada. Before starting this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. Let's get started. The best things to do in Vancouver cover all this and more with a collection of attractions that are informed by its history as much as its future. There are whales too. From April through October, you're practically guaranteed a sighting. Number 1. Stanley Park This must-see park is a whopping 1,000 acres and contains beaches, an aquarium, playgrounds, a pool and splash park, botanical gardens, a golf course, 17 tennis courts and much more. With all the park offers, you could easily spend a day within its perimeter. Try biking the exterior seawall or venture inside to get lost amongst ferns and centuries-old cedars on 40 miles of trails. Keep an eye out for beavers, raccoons, great blue herons, bald eagles, coyotes, and sometimes even whales. In the fall, ride the ghost train for a spooky Halloween experience. Number 2. Rich Midnight Market Open weekends and holiday evenings from May to October. This is the largest night market in North America. The Richmond Night Market will give you a taste of Asia's famed night markets. Sample foods like grilled squid, foo fries, juices, roti mac and cheese, and nitrogen ice cream at the food stalls. Then shop for gifts and accessories at the retail stalls. There are games, live music and entertainment, and always great people watching. Number 3. Pacific Arts Market This nearly 2,000, 500 square foot gallery space features art, jewelry, and other handmade crafts from more than 40 artists from Vancouver and around British Columbia. Browse talented local artists and bring home a unique souvenir. You'll find paintings, ceramics, jewelry, wood carving, fiber arts, and products like handmade candles and teas. The colorful space is packed with art for every taste and budget. Artists change regularly so it's worth visiting again and again. Number 4. Dr. Sun Yat-sen Chinese Garden This tranquil garden at the edge of Chinatown is the first Chinese garden, or scholar's garden, built outside of China. Designed and built by specialists from Suzhou, where the Ming Dynasty-era scholar's gardens that inspired this one are located, using rare trees, prized rocks, and the principles of balance and harmony. The Chinese garden is an oasis of tranquility, Stroll the free park, then enter the gardens by paid admission. Learn the symbolism behind the placement of each plant, structure, and path, or just enjoy peace, quiet, and beauty. Number 5. Vancouver Whale Watch British Columbia has a wealth of marine life, including orcas, humpbacks, seals, dolphins, and more. A conservation-minded whale watch tour like Vancouver Whale Watch offers an up-close look at the stunning creatures and an educational experience. Learn about whale biology and migration, marine conservation, and more as you witness the beauty of Vancouver's waters. Number 6. The Seawall The 17.5-mile paved pathway starts at the Vancouver Convention Center and then winds around Stanley Park to English Bay, False Creek, Olympic Village, Granville Island, Kitsilano Beach, and the beaches of Spanish Banks. The 5.5-mile section in Stanley Park is the most popular, but tackling the whole seawall will give you an excellent and an active tour of Vancouver. It's the world's longest uninterrupted waterfront path, and you'll see mountains, sculptures, the skyline, and beaches. Number 7. Rogers Arena Home of the Vancouver Canucks hockey team. That Stanley Cup has to come eventually, surely. Rogers Arena hosts major concerts and events throughout the year. During hockey season, Checking out a Canucks game is a must. Canadians love hockey, and Vancouver adores their Canucks, no matter how wonderful or frustrating they may be. Catch the spirit from October to April, May or June, depending on how the team's doing. Number 8. Grouse Mountain Packed with towering trees, these botanical gardens are a great spot to unwind or take a few nature selfies. Van Dusen Botanical Garden is 55 acres of green and splashes of color with 7,500 plant species from all over the world. There is a picturesque lake and a hedge maze made from 3,000 cedars. Number 9. Gastown The original downtown core of Vancouver, Gastown is now a vibrant, trendy neighborhood with unique shopping, dining, art galleries, and more. 
densely packed but stylish, it is all cobblestone streets and beautifully refurbished buildings. After browsing the boutiques and galleries, grab a cocktail or dinner and make it a night out. This is also where you'll find the famous Gastown Steam Clock, one of only a few working steam clocks in the world. Every quarter hour, the clock shoots steam from its five whistles, and on the hour, it gives off a toot from each whistle. Number 10. English Bay Beach Located in the West End, English Bay is a bustling neighborhood of beaches, shopping, and dining and hosts annual events like the Celebration of Light Fireworks Competition and the Vancouver Polar Bear Swim. In the summer, English Bay Beach draws throngs for sunbathing and swimming, but the whole neighborhood is a top destination year-round for shopping, dining, waterfront strolling, beautiful scenery, and art. Don't miss the Laughing Man statues or the Inukshuk Monument. Head to Sunset Beach for, you guessed it, beautiful sunset views. What do you think about this video? Do let us know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.